three to one of you guys. You were within four points with just a few minutes to go. Then can you explain what went on after that? I say our defensive focus and intensity uh, wavered for a hot second, and they uh, separated. Yeah, I agree. Um, defensively, we got some bad cuts and got some action on the ball screens. We got to be tighter on that, and then we didn't really execute. So we got to make some more free throws. Yeah, Jay. Sorry. Jay, your coach was in here and he said he felt that there are times you guys maybe didn't fully take, I guess, Lipscomb seriously in this game and said like some of the bad cuts and things paid for it. Do you feel like that was kind of the case, you know, coming off two wins and maybe didn't fully prepare as well as you need to for Lipscomb? Um, I'd say there were some casual moments, uh, perhaps in practice and shoot around, which you might be referring to. And uh, we, something that he always says is that we can't afford to be casual. We, uh, we have to be locked in and focused at all times in order to win. Kenny was talking about how he'll run three hour practices and so he feels satisfied that the needs have been addressed. What's your guys' reaction to running practice so long, and do you feel like the needs are being addressed in those long practices? Um, I say they are being addressed. Um, it's just our attention to detail and focus uh, is probably, and, and casualness is probably the piece that he's more so waiting on. Yeah. A big factor in this game is they made 18 layups. Um, I think they were like 11 for 13 in the first half. You guys are a bigger, uh, physically stronger team. How do you explain that their ability to, to get so many easy shots? Um, I feel like, you know, with the back cuts, uh, Bella hits a lot of layups, and Deuce, Deuce is hugging a man and shouldn't be, uh, you know, not in help. And that led to layups. And, um, you know, the big guy was, was Getting it at the rim and working in the post, and that, that led to some more layups. And transition as well. Yeah, JJ, uh, Kenny talked a little bit about it too, about guys kind of tight struggling to finish at the rim. Might be tough to answer, but can you figure out or pinpoint, I guess, what that is? Like it's focus thing or just, you know, struggling to finish sometimes through contact and at the rim? I just felt like guys got to explode more, you know. we They weren't very athletic, the team, you know. So we got to get better at getting to the spot, jumping over the top of them and finishing. I feel like we didn't use that, our athleticism to get above them. I feel like we just stayed on the same level. JJ, you kind of spoke to the athleticism piece and the size advantage you guys have. How do you pinpoint the, the struggles on the backboard, like on the glass? Because I think they only got you 40 and 26. Um, that's just effort, honestly. Um, effort and uh, seeing the ball, you know, I feel like they were attacking the, the rebounds harder than we were. And it should definitely be the op opposite. And then um, on our end, we, I think we missed like 34 shots, so we should have more offensive rebounds and feel like give a bigger effort in that. Uh, yeah, Coach talked about how the schedule is the schedule. You got NC State in two days, um, only ACC games in Kentucky left to go. What's the mindset going forward uh, as the schedule gets more difficult? Um, we really wanted this win really bad, just so we can feel a lot better going into the, those next two games. You know, NC State's a really good team. But um, we just got to keep working and keep fighting, and things will turn around. Anything else for these guys? Okay. Kenny. Um, for both of 
to you, I guess JJ can go first. Um, is it surprising to you that 11 games into the season, we're still talking about effort and making effort plays 40 minutes in the game? Uh, yeah, I would say that it's surprising. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I would say. Yeah, I agree, it's, it's definitely surprising with how deep into the season, or deep into the season we are. Um, I say we definitely had a lot of moments this game where we did show a lot of uh, focus and resilience as far as the effort plays and I guess communicating, but kind of wavered once uh, it became more of a tight game. And I feel like our effort is there for the most part. I think it's just our attention to detail and staying locked in. That's the part that's surprising and that we got to work on. Anything else? All right, thanks, guys.